Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I am Lugnus Monster, and this is day number seven of our Star Wars Black series 12 Days of Christmas Advent Calendar. If you are new to the channel and you haven't been keeping up, this is a series on the channel where we have been opening a brand new Star Wars Black series figure every day leading up until Christmas, and today is day number seven. If you didn't miss the last six days, make sure to go check them out. They are up on the channel, so make sure to go check those out. But uh, yeah, today we're going to be opening up another Black series figure. So let's go ahead and open up day number seven and uh, see what figure we get and uh, here are the remaining six presents just waiting to be opened so let's go ahead and open up day seven and uh, see what we get Alrighty, day number seven we did get number 11 and we also got uh hershey's bar as well so that's pretty cool let's go ahead and uh open up number 11. Alrighty, so we got Day number 11 right here. Let's go ahead and get it open. Alrighty, up. so opening up day number 11. Pretty cool. Um, not really sure what this figure is yet, so that is a mystery, but let's go ahead and get it open up and uh, find out. Ooh, okay, we got Jen Erso. That is a great addition to complete our uh, Rogue One shelf, I do believe. Uh, how many do we have left? So we do have now, we have Cassian, uh, we have uh, the blind guy, I cannot remember his name. Uh, we also have K2SO, and now Jen. So we're only looking at a few Rogue One people left, which is awesome. So this is a great addition to our Rogue One shelf. Let's go ahead and get this guy out of the box. So yeah, really happy they decided to go ahead and uh, do the like photo reel update of the Rogue One figures. Uh, the original Rogue One figures were really, really bad when it came to, like, the face printing and everything, so it's, uh, nice to see that they actually took the time to re-release these figures, and plus I do really love the, like, uh, bluish-green color that the boxes are. It looks awesome, and, uh, yeah, just really happy, so I know, um, I know there are several different versions of Jin in the line, so, um, you know, you could always... Uh, do a head swap if you wanted to and swap out the head for a different version but i really wish it went ahead and made the uh like the imperial disguise version that we saw at the end of the movie and they didn't make that version of her so i really wish they would go and do that but it's not the end of the world and of course she does have her blaster pretty cool let's go ahead and get her all set up so here we got Jen all set up, and I do have to say, I am really liking the face update on this one. It looks pretty dang good. I know on some of the other ones, kind of like the like archive figures where they did some of the photo reel updates, they just didn't look great. And this one is an exception, because this one looks pretty good. So happy to see that this came out all right. Will say, though, I wish they would have just went ahead and made a whole new figure rather than doing the re-releases. Just because the articulation on this one is pretty poor, barely I don't even know if that is 90. I don't think she really gets 90 the elbows. The legs have the double jointed legs, so they're kind of wobbly and unstable. So not a not a bad figure overall. I think it's a great update, but uh, I think it would have definitely benefited just from a brand new mold altogether. But uh, let's go ahead and get her uh, set up in the Rogue One shelf. Anyway, there we go. We got her all set up in the Rogue One shelf looking good. Uh, love K2SO joining them there as well. So yeah, pretty excited. And I uh, cannot wait to complete the Rogue One shelf. I believe we only need Blaze now. I could be wrong. No, we need Blaze and uh, Bodhi or Rhodey. Don't remember his name. I think it's Brody. B Bodhi. I don't, I don't necessarily know his name. It's been a long time since I've seen that movie. But yeah, we're almost done with the Rogue One shelf. Looking pretty cool. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. If you did enjoy it, the like button and subscribe. And make sure to come back tomorrow so you guys can see what the remaining five days of Christmas are. And, uh, yeah, if you did enjoy it, like, just hit that like button, subscribe. It helps out the channel a lot, and I do really, really appreciate it. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.